Hi, I'm your Binibini One, Vicky Marie Milagros Russian from Negros Occidental. My childhood years was mostly marked with pain, but I used that pain to be my source of strength. My family life is full of love. You'll hear, you'll hear I love yous every day, hugs and kisses everywhere, and that's all because of my brother. And I used that strength, and I used that pain to be my source of strength. And the love that I get from my family is more than enough. That's why I can say that I'm stronger than ever. I've been through a lot in my life. That's why I value all the life lessons that I have learned. There are a few things that I want my future family, that I want to pass on to my future family. First, I'd remind them that we only have one life. So, never seek validation from others. Be who you decide to be and not what others expect or want you to be. Second, it's okay to change. Change is growth. So allow yourself to grow. And third, it's okay to feel pain. So cry if you have to. Allow yourself to heal and remember to forgive. Remember, hurt people hurt people, but healed people heal people. Started when I was in college, when our organization adopted a community called Home for the Blind. We'd visit them, um, conduct a feeding program, um, we teach them how to take care of themselves, proper hygiene, proper care, self-care, and we allow them or we give them a chance to, to generate income from massage. That's why this is an advocacy that I chose because this is something that is close to me. I want I have all, I've always had a soft spot for PWDs. I wanted to reach out. I want to help. So maybe that's also because of my brother and my mom, because my mom is blind and my brother has Down syndrome. So if only I can touch hearts and if I can also transform their lives, I would. This is my second national pageant. The most mem memorable pageant experience and also the most embarrassing experience for me is when we were asked to prepare for a song number. So to tell you guys, I am not a singer. So I was st standing there. I got the first few lines right and forgot the rest. <laughs> and I even asked the audience, what's the lyrics, what's the lyrics? <laughs> like that. So for me, that was the most memorable and also the most embarrassing experience. Aside from winning a crown, I know being a Bini Bini will put me in a position where with greater influence wherein I can spread an awareness to spread awareness about my advocacy. Um, I want I really wanted to be a voice for PWDs and their families.